That, that is interesting. So you'd say you, you are very much a, a several-sided person. Uh, <laughs> a little bit literally, yeah. A little literally. Okay, a little, literally. So literally? Uh, so I have this condition called dissociative identity disorder. And what that is is basically, for anyone who's seen Split, um, it's the main character has it. It's yeah, the, yeah. the disorder where your brain uses multiple people uh, to cope with a trauma. So I had my trauma wow. as a kid, we won't get into that, but now I've got this coping mechanism, which yeah. is like I get super stressed, a different personality comes out to front, you know, to, to bear that guilt or whatever. That uh, is very fascinating. <laughs> so, uh, so trauma happened, mm -hmm. and then how does your brain turn this into the coping mechanism, can I ask? Like what, what, what happens that that is the coping mechanism? Uh, so in the case that like I'm Bo right now, but in the cal, yeah. just refer to myself in the third person to make it easy. Sure. If Bo gets too stressed, yeah. maybe a different personality who my brain has turned into someone who can take stress will come oh, out okay. to exist for a bit. And it's I've had it for diagnosed at least for like seven years now, maybe six years. So at this point, we've got a kind of system going on where every time I'm too stressed, they'll just immediately go out to take it for me. And yeah. they'll, they know to act like me a little bit and to not use their accents and stuff like that. Oh my God, they have accents? Oh, some of them. <laughs> this is amazing. Okay, so I have to, I'm a big fan of Dungeons and Dragons. Mm -hmm. It's like you have a D&D &D team inside of you and it's like, it's time for a barbarian gym to come out. Oh, like, this that's is amazing. Pretty much, that's pretty much it. Wow.